So when it comes to illegal migration, the UK receives tens of thousands every single year. But as well as not being invited, the migrants also have something else in common. They all head straight for the cities. And it's something which has never made any sense to me, because this is a photo of green rolling hills. However, this isn't Wales, nor is it Yorkshire, because believe it or not, this is Afghanistan, and you might be wondering where all of the sand is, but it's a pretty large country, and this photo is from up north in a much colder region. But it actually looks pretty nice. Dare I say, it kinda looks like England. In fact, when we put them side by side, it would be hard to tell which is which. They both look quiet and peaceful, and you could live off the land with all the room to move. So it would really make sense for Afghan Alan to move to an English village, but instead, they come here. An overwhelming concrete jungle full of noise, cars, flashing lights and air pollution, and they'll also be facing a major cost of living increase as well. But my question to you today is why do they do this? Why go to a city when you can come to a village? I'm not exactly inviting them to come and live next to me, but I genuinely can't figure out why they do this. You would think it might be job opportunities, but most of these people just end up on benefits anyway. So honestly, I'm just going to have to leave this one up to you in the comments to try and get to the bottom of it. But you won't be alone, because I'll see you there.